Track 1 Unit 1 Life Page 10 1 Let's remember telling the time. Study the clock below, then listen and repeat. O'clock Five past Ten past a quarter past. Twenty past. Twenty five past. Half past. Twenty five two. Twenty two. A quarter two. Ten two. Five two. Track two, page eleven. Three. Before you listen, remember the months. Read, listen, and repeat. January. February. March April May June July August September October November December Track 3, page 12 5. Listen and match the photos with the dates and time. 1. What's the date today, teacher? September 21st, 2019, Susan. What is the time? It's 11 o'clock. 2. What's the date today, Doc? The July 2019. What time is it? It's a quarter to three. 3. What's the date today, George? It's the 12th of February, 2019. What time is it? It's ten past two. Oh no, I'm very late. Four. What's the date today, Claire? 6th of April, 2019, Mandy. What's the time? It's half past one. Let's go to the chess club for the tournament. Track 4, page 13. 9. Listen and tick the topic off the dialogue. What's the date today, Mum? It's the 5th of June. Why? Kelly's birthday is on the 20th of June. I want to buy a present. That's nice. When is John's birthday? It is on the 31st of December. Track 5. Page 14. 14. Listen and number the picture groups. Write the numbers in the boxes. One. Hi, I'm Jim. I wake up at seven o'clock on weekdays. I go to the bathroom, take a shower and get dressed for school. I have my breakfast at half past seven. Two. I leave home at eight o'clock and take the school bus. Classes begin at half past eight and finish at three o'clock.
I have my lunch at school. I go back home after school. Three. I arrive home at quarter past three and have tea and cookies with my mother. I rest for thirty minutes and do my homework before dinner. The dinner is at about a quarter to eight. Four. After dinner, my parents watch TV or read magazines. I go to my room and surf on the internet. At nine o'clock, I go to bed. Five. I don't get up early at the weekend. We visit my grandparents and have our breakfast there at about half past ten. After breakfast, I meet my friends. We run errands like doing shopping with my family on Sundays. Track six, page seventeen, twenty-two. Listen and complete the sentence. What do you do after school, Lisa? I go home and I do my homework, Mark. I go to my step dance class on Wednesdays, and I play tennis on Fridays. I don't go out on the other weekdays. What about you? I go home and I finish all my homework too. I take care of my dog and bird. I attend a traditional dance course on Wednesdays. I don't run errands on weekdays. What about your sister? What does she do after school? She rests after school. She doesn't attend any courses because she is very little. She helps my mother at home and spends time with her toys. What does she do at school? She listens to the teacher. They sing songs and play games. Oh, how nice! Track seven, page twenty. Twenty-seven. Listen and answer the question: What pet does Molly have? My sister Molly is only fifteen years old, but she is very busy. She has some errands to run. On weekdays, she goes to ballet classes at four o'clock after school. On Saturdays. She gets up at eight o'clock. First, she feeds her cat and makes breakfast for the family. She likes it. Then, she gets dressed and goes to the central park for jogging at half past ten. She doesn't have a bicycle, so she walks two kilometers to the park. She comes back home at half past twelve, takes a shower, and helps my mother for lunch. In the afternoon, she rests in her bed for an hour, but she doesn't take a nap. She reads a book. Later, she does shopping and meets her friends at the cafe nearby at a quarter to four. When she returns home, she takes care of the plants in the garden. After dinner, she does her homework, watches TV, and we play computer games. She goes to bed at half past nine because next day is full of activities too. <laughs>